Monty, um, tell me how the new team's gelling, fair few new signings, Noah Smith's back on board, tell me about that. Yeah, it's obviously from the final eight weeks ago, well, I think it was just eight weeks ago, it seems a little bit of a blur, but um, yeah, it's a bit of a rebuild at the minute, we've lost probably half the starting team from, from the final, but for us, I don't see that as, as anything but other than success. I think players going overseas to top clubs in Europe and, and, and Asia, that's what the club's about. And for us, it's about rebuilding. And you know, when one door closes, another one opens. And I, I used that last season with Nectar and Brian, you know, losing Kai Rolls, everybody panicked. And, and you know, if we didn't lose Kai Rolls, then Nectar and, and Brian probably don't come in and play last season. So I think that's a good example. Uh, but you know, we're in the midst of a rebuild now. We're only a couple of weeks back into pre-season. Um, you know, we finished later than everybody else after the final, so you know, rightly the boys had a had a break and a holiday, and, and yes, yeah, you know, I don't know anywhere in the world where you play a competitive game three weeks into pre-season, um, but that seems to happen to us uh, every season. But yeah, that's the cup, and, and yeah, we'll be ready. We'll be as ready as we can. The new boys have settled in. Noah, obviously, Docker, the Brazilian boy. Uh, Alou's back and, and, and Jing Reese as well, so some familiar faces that don't need much time to settle in. Um, and right now, yeah, we're still trying to bring in a couple of visa players, and there's still uh, there's still funds in the budget to strengthen the squad. But the A League doesn't start until the 20th of October, so we're not in a crazy rush to bring everybody in because if we do that and rush and, and make panic signings, then you know most likely they'll be the wrong players for the club. So um, yeah, it's just a waiting game at the minute and speaking to agents and players, but. One thing we're not short of is players wanting to come to the club. They just have to be the right fit. And, and you mentioned Noah Smith there. He's a player that we, I didn't want to lose a few years ago. He uh, Contractually, he was um, sort of taken by, by victory, which was our our fault. But the opportunity to bring back Noah back from Brisbane after probably not you know not really kick-starting his career. Um, and he gives us some real strength in depth. So that's that's one thing that we need with the, with the three competitions this season. Yeah, ideally, I think it would have been nice to get a, an MPL fixture. You know, considering that we've only had uh, you know two and a half, two weeks training, but it is what it is. You know, how we get the same fixture two years in a row baffles me. It really does. I think the odds on that were were, were pretty stacked against us. Um, but it's down in Wollongong. It's a neutral venue. Uh, it's a stadium that I I like. Um, and and yeah, it's it's going to be uh, yeah, it's a pre-season game. Reality is, it's a pre-season game. I think they've had a couple of extra weeks than us to to, to train, so that's uh, that's good for them. But for us, no excuses. You know, we've we've got a young team. We're in the midst of a rebuild, and we'll go there we're looking to win the game on Sunday. How was the training camp in Thailand? Yeah, no, it was really good. Again, with the AFC Cup, we felt it was really important that we went to uh, a climate that was hot and humid, and and no, it was good to get the group together. A lot of young players came as well from the MPL, so for them it was an opportunity and. You know, right now we're you know we're, we're short on numbers, so you know the opportunity for a few of them is uh, is one that yeah that that I'm sure they'll uh, they'll, they'll they'll really grab with, with two hands, and and some of them will no doubt be involved on on the game this Sunday. Is the pressure on now to kick off this Australian Cup NA League campaign really well, and given you know your last performance in the Grand Final? I don't think there's any pressure on us whatsoever. We sold half the team from the final. We're still the lowest budget and the youngest team, so. If there's pressure on us, then I won't feel it, and the boys won't feel it. Of course, you know we're, we're champions of of the country, so you know people are going to uh, want to beat you. Yeah, but the reality is, it's a it's a different pressure because most of that team's gone, and the rest of the boys coming in now, you know, they've got the responsibility of playing for the club that is the champions of of Australia. So um, yeah, it, it's yeah, I don't see how we'll be pressure on us when you, you consider everything but if we are then that's yeah we re <laughs> that's big respect for the club and, and we'll take that on board. And is it great to see you know I saw Sammy kick his first goal with Middlesbrough I think last week is it great to see those boys go on and, and that talent from the club and that you've nurtured? Yeah I speak to Sammy and Nectar all the time the championships just, just kicked off but yeah to see Sammy you know making his debut last week at Middlesbrough and, and Nectar making his debut at Sunderland um, yeah, it's obviously really proud. You know, the boys are, are really happy. You know, they're in the big leagues now. You know, it's one of the biggest leagues in the, in the world. Um, it's a tough league, but league I know really well. But yeah, really happy for Sammy. You know, scoring in the cup that will give him confidence. And you know, they're all they're all rooting for for the boys here. And yeah, again, we you know we're quite a way away from the start of the A League. But right now, we've uh, yeah we've got this cup competition and we've got AFC to prepare for. Yeah, that's the plan now. So, so AFC is soon after. 
Yeah, I think it's uh, towards the end of September. Um, but again, I think we're just waiting for the actual fixtures. So yeah, really, like we're in pre-season, we're a couple of weeks into pre-season. So yeah, we prepare. We're going to have as many games as possible and make sure that when we go into that AFC Cup, um, you know, we're, we're we're ready and hopefully we've uh, completed the squad. But yeah, I think uh, yeah that that's going to be an ongoing process right until the A League starts. So yeah, that's a bit of an update.